during the SAP S4 HANA conversions, migration projects and rollouts, companies quite often set up landscape with business as usual tracks and the project tracks also known as N plus one systems. It is a great way to separate the business as usual and the project requirements, but it also comes with a price. In such landscapes, the external systems and EDI partners are usually connected only to a business as usual track. So the question is, what can we do with the project tracks? How can we test them? The typical situation is that companies prepare the middleware platform to work with both project and business as usual track, which of course is good. But then they try to connect the real testing system to a project track, either by switching it from the business as usual track for a specific period and then switching it back, or they even try to set up a new test system from a third party apps. The complexity of this endeavor is huge and it's not always as good as expected due to some challenges. What are these challenges? First, setting up a new test system for all those external applications can be very expensive and requires a lot of coordination. The alternative way, switching the connections from business as usual to project tracks also requires lots of internal work and communication. Secondly, even if you have the connections ready, the biggest issue and something that slows down the project is the ping pong communication. Meaning if you want to test something in the SAP landscape, you have to ask someone on the order system to send you the exact data you want. So some point of contacts uh, has to be available in the time you want to perform the testing. You need to either call them or send the email and coordinate everything. If you want to retest something, the same procedure repeats. The last challenge can be a test data issue. Even if you switch 10 or 20 test systems and coordinated all the people to send test data, you have no guarantee that test data in the external systems are correct. Sounds challenging, huh? But no worries. Now I would like to show you how to mitigate these challenges with the INT4 suite by changing the approach. First, you need to realize that in most cases, what is the subject to change are not the external systems, but what you have within your SAP landscape. It means that there is no need to connect and switch test systems to your project tracks, at least not at the beginning of the project, because you can just easily simulate those systems and decouple them using the historical messages you already have. At the time you simulate the messages, you can define to which track they should be sent, business as usual or a project track. The messages used for the simulation can be collected automatically by int for suite robot, which can gather the production data and save them as test cases in the relevant folders with a specific business scenario. Coming back to our standard approach, there is no need to switch the connections because you can simulate external systems and send collected messages to the project or business as usual track whenever needed in the form they were taken from the production or with some modifications if needed. That solves the problem of the test data because you can actually test on the reliable messages that you already use, for example, in the production environment. But the biggest value is the removing of the dependency on the third party apps for testing. Because you have the test data collected, you can test on any number of messages you want and whenever you want. You don't have to call the point of contacts or coordinate availability of all the people when you want to test, which saves a lot of time. What is important is that it helps you regardless of the fact if you are a developer who wants to test the code remediation or a business user who wants to test customization done in the new system. And of course, maybe at some point you would like to test your business processes and interfaces end to end with the messages sent from the external systems. But in the first phase of the project, you can just simulate them and by the same time speed up the development processes 
and apply the shift left approach to find all the issues earlier when the cost of fixing them is significantly less. With the int 4 suite, you can not only save real messages that can be used for testing, but at the same time you can test and send data dynamically to the track you want. Thank you for watching.